This model kit review is of the uh, Aston Martin DB5. This is the James Bond car. This model is by Airfix and it's a 132nd scale. I actually uh, bought this thinking it was a 124th scale and I didn't read the, uh, <laughs> the ad. This box is a little beat up. It actually comes with um, some brushes, which looks like they're pretty good quality, some cement and paint. This paint uh, has definitely separated but uh, usually that can easily be uh, put back in. Uh, here we have the uh, dimensions and a uh, picture of the car. Let's have a look on the back. Here's the uh, painting guide. So let's have a look inside. This is gonna be smaller than the regular 2425 scale. As you can see, this is a much smaller car. And, uh, let's have a look at our screws. This does look like a much older mold. And looking at the details here, it's not very well molded at all, which is unusual for Airfix. So here's the chassis. Not a lot of detail. We've got our wheel wells inside of our uh, cockpit. Some very terrible mold lines here. Badly molded, a lot of flashing. Not very well molded at all. This is likely a very old mold that they're using. Here's our steering wheel also. Mold lines there. Another body part there. Here's our glass. Here's a dashboard. Looks like our exhausts and axle probably. Here are our seats. We've got wheels. Also not very well molded. You can see here the inside there are flashing. We've got some engine parts with flashing and mold lines. Here's our uh, axle and uh, coils, and parts of the wheels, not well molded, and our front grille and bumpers. Here's the uh, rear seat. Let's have a look here at uh, Instructions. So we start off with the uh, axles and drivetrain going onto the uh, chassis. Then the uh, cockpit's put together and uh, bumpers, lights, exhausts. And that's it. Very basic model. Not a lot of detail and not very well molded.